Hi everyone, my name is Paul, I'm an industrial designer and I'll be your teacher for this course. With many years of experience as an industrial designer using Rhino, I developed a strong expertise in 3D. I've worked in different industries such as consumer electronic products dedicated to cars, but also bespoke furniture and light installation for interior design. And through all those years of using Rhino, I've developed specific workflows for industrial design. I wanted to share my knowledge and create a course that covers everything you need to know to make 3Ds when you're an industrial designer. I created a course uh, which I wish I had when I started um, learning Rhino. This course covers different uh, things. So we start with the basics. You will learn how to use the interface where to find uh, everything you need, how to get organized. Then uh, you'll learn how to uh, create curves, surface, solid uh, and simple geometries. So that's all for the basics. And we will go into like more complex geometries, more intricate detail, and how to set up reference picture to model an object that uh, you've uh, drawn. Uh, for example, if you made some sketches, you will learn how to uh, put reference pictures and modelize at the correct scale with those pictures. You will also learn how to create redundant detail from the industrial design fields. So for example, how to create buttons, how to create connectors, how to create part lines between a different material and an object, how to apply a pattern to a surface, how to create interesting geometries that doesn't look like you just modelize a box, but it, it will actually look like you modelize an object with an emotion and, and the idea is uh, for you to be able to, as a creative, not be afraid when you go to 3D to lose uh, this emotion that you were able to have uh, through your sketches, for example. So the idea is to use the 3D as a tool that will help you uh, develop your concept and bring it to the real world. So for example, you will learn also how to uh, use your 3D for 3D printing and uh, also how to make technical drawings within Rhino with the layout tool and also how to create outlines of your objects uh, for uh, if you want to export it also into other software such as Illustrator. So the course will cover all of this and it will be step by step so you will never be lost and all the aspects will be covered through different exercises so that everything is not theoretical that you can actually see um, where a specific technique can be applied and thanks to this you will be able to mimic details that you see from objects that you like and to apply it to your 3Ds. So if it's something that sounds like you want to learn, uh, let's get started then.